Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is your favorite Wookie Chewy. Thank you for tuning in to get your daily dose of penny stock goodness. Before I jump into the sweet find I got for you guys today, please don't forget to like this video, subscribe to this channel, share this video. And when I say share this video, I mean tell your girlfriend, tell your wife, tell your mom, hell, even tell your dog, because it's about to get nutty. Also, don't forget to check out our socials linked down below. Now sit back, relax, grab a drink, and let's get into the good stuff. The company I'm about to present to you guys is a company that I personally find interesting. The Image Project Company, ticker symbol IMTL, which was founded in 1997. With a combination of creativity, technology, innovation, and design, IMTL has become a global leader in the end-to-end -end copyright infringement sector. So what exactly is IMTL? IMTL is a platform for revolutionary technology for image rights management and protection aiming to register and manage digital content for the creative community with the help of artificial intelligence. With the never-ending evolution of technology, every day, there's just no telling how far digital content companies can go. And this is exactly why this company caught my eye. First things first, let me introduce you to the company's management team. The CEO and Chairman, Lawrence Adams. The President and COO, Jonathan Thomas. As well as the Accountant, Richard Eldison. Moving on to the company's key data, IMTL has a market cap of 37,764,148 authorized shares of 3,750,000,000 and outstanding shares of 3,529,359,629, which puts the company in a good position in the stock market. While digging into this company, I was able to come across some catalysts that I'm pumped to share with you all. Let's check them out. Forming partnerships and legal agreements is one of many popular ways to rise in the market. Partnerships can be made to unite against violation of copyrights, and this is the main reason IMTL took this step. IMTL took a decision to expand its strategic partnership with Kodak One Image Rights Management Platform to include cases of violation of digital image rights in the domestic market of the United States. Previously, the partnership was only set up to resolve international cases involving countries other than the United States. The previous CEO of the company, Matthew Goldman, stated that this is a large expansion in the scope of initial partnership with Kodak One. He also added that the flow of settlement opportunities has been enhanced by the U.S. infringement caseload. The expanded scope of the partnership resulted in the company agreeing to migrate data from U.S. client cases through an API system that includes approximately 700,000 additional images and 300,000 additional infringement sightings. This is a significant increase for the partnership, which was originally formed to target only international infringement cases. And according to Kodak One's team predictions, at the time of signing, related sales will be limited to approximately 5 million. Mr. Goldman concluded that they have been monitoring how the relationship was working in accordance to how they were adapting the back-end platform technology and the partnership seemed like a logical progression to extend the scale and reach of the company to include greater market share. Violation of copyrights often happens in many non-ethical companies. Thus, this partnership agreement is an effective way to prevent such thievery from happening. Generating and sharing profits Combining resources, brainstorming ideas, etc. are not the only benefits companies gain from partnership agreements. Sometimes, unity against other competitors or threats is an essential matter to avoid risk and rise in the market. It's logical to assume that hardly anyone would take the risk to invest in a company with a shaky reputation. In order to increase its shareholders and gain their trust, a company must become verified in the OTC market. On March 1st, IMTL became verified in the OTC market. This means that shareholders considering to invest in this company will be able to access its up-to-date information and publish financial reports. The ability to access a company's financial reports is key to comprehending more about the company's market position. And with this decision, we are anticipating a rise in the stock price. 
It was also decided that IMTL will hire a PR firm, which is some hot news that would catch the eye of any stock trader. Becoming verified in the OTC market is not the only way to find investors. Hiring a PR firm is a smart move by IMTL to enhance its reputation, which is a crucial way of attracting new clients and investors. And if you're thinking right now, this decision and increase in productivity may also arise, you're probably right. Meetings with employees to come up with media strategies will no longer be required since it's all in the hands of the hired PR team. Thus, the company's staff will be allowed to spend more time doing other important stuff. Hiring a PR firm would also reduce the cost of using various strategies that companies are now expected to employ in order to expand and bring in new clients. IMTL will be receiving social media and SEO advantages thanks to this decision, which means that financial annual and quarterly reports, announcements and more up-to-date news will be available for anyone to look up, which in turn will increase the attention around this stock and further shoot up its price. Furthermore, IMTL announced that their infringement revenue will begin regenerating again in April. Despite how frustrating infringement actually is, the copyright owner is able to benefit from the infringement by gaining a revenue compensation. The company can be awarded the infringer's profits only if the infringer's income exceeds the real damages suffered by the copyright owner. IMTL can invest these revenues into new projects, and that would probably increase its stock prices if the project were to succeed. As a result, profiting from an infringer whose true motive is to hurt the business. Another announcement concerning the generating of IMTL's revenues is that they are signing a travel and nature agency representing 60 plus National Geographic photographers who own over 700,000 images. I believe taking such a step might play a huge turning point for the company, enhancing its reputation and generating revenues. We're talking big numbers here, 700,000 images. IMTL has taken several decisions that seem to be a great turning point for the company. In my opinion, the company being verified in the OTC market is the most interesting part of it all, and I'm looking forward to keeping updated with their stock price as I'm expecting great outcomes from this company. Hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I did took a lot of effort to put together. If you can like this video, share, and subscribe, that would be awesome. Don't forget to check out our socials and some goodies I left for you guys down below. This has been your Wookie Chewy, and I'll see you tomorrow.